think, long and hard, conjure her up in your mind, what would she say? What's her final statement to a cold, uncaring planet? Dear world, believe it or not, I knew about fear, I knew the way loneliness stung. I hid behind smiles and crazy hot clothes, I learned to kiss boys with my tongue. That's good. But all the world had held me down. It weighed like a concrete prom queen crown. No one thinks a pretty girl has feelings. Supply. Keep going. This has to be good enough to fool the cops. Whoa! Is it murder? No. It's a suicide note. They couldn't see past my rock star mystique. They wouldn't dare look in my eyes. But just underneath was a terrified girl who clings to her pillow and cries. My looks were just like prison bars. They left me a myriad of scars. <laughs> myriad? Nice. No one thinks a pretty girl has substance. That's the curse of popularity. popularity. I am more than just a source of hand jobs. No one sees the me inside of me. your everyday suicide. You should cancel classes. No way, coach. I sent the kids home before lunch and the switchboard will light up like a Christmas tree. Our children are dying. I suggest we get everyone into the cafeteria and just talk and feel together. Thank you, Miss Fleming. Call me when the shuttle lands. Ah, <laughs> I'm telling you we all misjudge Heather Chandler. This is the loveliest suicide note I've ever read. Clothing for goodwill and give the poor minority track. Donate my car to purple kids or to those get a mums on crack. Give them my hats and my CDs, my pumps, my flats, my three TVs. No one thinks a pretty girl has feelings, but I weep for all I failed to be. Not so fast, kids. They're refueling the buses, which gives us a solid half hour of healing. I've mimeographed copies of the suicide notes so you can feel Heather's anguish. I never knew about her pain. Go on. Her life had hit a rocky patch. Feel. Deep down, she wasn't cruel or vain. Feel. She didn't mean to be a snatch. Veronica, you're very quiet. What's on your mind? Uh, maybe Heather realized that in order to be happy, she had to give up her power? And the only way to do that was... Death? <gasps> My god! Look what we've done, we're breaking through! Heather would be so proud of you! No one thinks a pretty girl can touch you! Heather touching me! <laughs> <laughs> 